On September 20, 2024, the Argentine Army received two Snowcat 1642 Tucker Terra all-terrain vehicles, bolstering its operational capacity in mountainous regions. Delivered to the Directorate of Arsenals in Boulogne, Buenos Aires Province, these vehicles are part of a broader modernization effort aimed at improving mobility in extreme environments. The newly acquired units are expected to be assigned to the 6th Mountain Hunter Company in Pinos, New Cain, and the 8th Mountain Hunter Company in Puente del Inca, Mendoza. The Snowcat 1642 Tucker Terra is a highly specialized vehicle designed to perform in harsh and challenging terrains, particularly in mountainous and snow-covered environments. Powered by a 173-horsepower Cummins diesel engine that complies with Tier 4 F emission standards, the Snowcat provides reliable performance while adhering to modern environmental regulations. Its Allison 2500 automatic transmission allows for smooth and efficient operation, ensuring the vehicle can handle the demanding conditions it was built for. One of the standout features of the Snowcat is its versatility in track configuration. Operators can choose between rubber tracks, which are 26 inches wide, and steel tracks that range from 28 to 38 inches, depending on the specific terrain needs. The vehicle's maximum width reaches 9 feet 9 inches when equipped with the widest steel tracks, while its height of 9 feet 7 inches allows it to navigate under obstacles. With a total length of 28 feet 8 inches, this robust vehicle can handle complex maneuvers in extreme conditions. Designed to support long missions in isolated and difficult-to-reach areas, the Snowcat 1642 has a large 50-gallon fuel tank, with the option to expand to 100 gallons, ensuring extended range in the field. The vehicle's load capacity is another critical asset, with a removable rear deck that can carry up to 3,000 pounds. This makes the Snowcat ideal for transporting both personnel and equipment in challenging environments. It has a standard seating capacity for 5 to 6 people, ensuring that it can transport a small team as well as critical supplies. Weighing between 13,850 and 17,900 pounds, depending on options, the Snowcat provides excellent ground clearance of 15 inches, allowing it to overcome significant obstacles. Despite its size, the vehicle maintains impressive maneuverability with a turning radius between 22 and 24 feet, making it an agile asset in tight or difficult spaces. The Argentine Army has emphasized the importance of the Snowcat in enhancing mobility for military operations and civil protection missions in mountainous regions. On social media, the Army highlighted how these vehicles will significantly improve support capabilities in isolated areas, particularly during winter when heavy snow can limit access. Last winter, the Army deployed snowcats to provide logistical support to Patagonian communities affected by severe snowfalls, showcasing their ability to assist in humanitarian missions. The versatility and ruggedness of these vehicles make them indispensable for both military and civil emergency responses. The acquisition of the Snowcat 1642 is part of a broader effort to strengthen the Argentine Army's operational capabilities in extreme environments. In addition to these vehicles, the Army is expecting to receive Bell 407 Gishi helicopters in late 2024, further enhancing its ability to provide air support and medical evacuations in remote areas. These helicopters will complement the existing fleet, including the SA-315 Lama helicopters, which were recently used during the School of Fire exercise in San Luis. The combination of the Snowcat 1642 Tucker Terra vehicles and the new helicopters represents a significant improvement in the Argentine Army's ability to conduct both military operations and humanitarian missions in some of the country's most challenging terrains. With these advanced platforms, the Army is better equipped to face the demands of modern military operations, ensuring mobility, support and rapid response in isolated areas, even under the harshest environmental conditions.